What is going on everybody? It's your boy Titanic Feet Jack and I'm back at you again with another video. Today we're going to take a look at the Air Jordan Retro 6 Midnight Navy. If this is your first time tuning in to the channel and you like what you see, go ahead and sub up to the channel. Also, if you want to follow me along this journey as I build my sneaker collection, you can follow me on my socials as well. Here's a list of them right on the screen. Now let's get right into it. Here we go. The Air Jordan Midnight Navy. It's the Retro 6. Little background on it. This sneaker initially released back in 2000. I mean, it came out with a different box back then, but it had the uh, the Jordan face box. You know the boxes that had the Jordan face on, the black and the silver box. That's the box these came out with back in 2000. And you know, it wasn't a, a hot release back then, but Jordan brand saw the need to retro this sneaker 22 years later. Back in 2000, what was I doing? Oh yeah, I believe I was living in Germany at that time. And I don't even remember that shoe, but I did get the uh, Space Jams and the uh, cool grades that came out around that time so I didn't see these I don't even remember these but I was collecting sneakers way back then so you know I've been collecting these sneakers for a while now so let's get right into it okay guys this is your box we're gonna read the box label first air Jordan 6 retro color white midnight navy US size 14 Oh, they actually left the MSRP on here. It says $190, but sneakers have didn't charge me $190. I was charged $210. But this is the box. Midnight Navy. Six on. Jaw Jump Man on top. Got a little nick right there, but Air Jordan branding on both sides. Pop the lid. Have my lot stamp right here. And you have the paper inside, the splatter. And you can see your YDM sticker on the inside. This is the box. Let's get into the sneak. Really nothing much to it. Here you go. I'm not going to even lie. I really wasn't checking for this sneaker. But I shot my shot on the sneakers app and I hit. So here we go. We got, look how tumble the leather is on your upper. It sinks in and everything. Nice soft leather, all white upper, as usual on your sixes. MJ up here, midsole, your midnight navy blue, which you hit a white as well. You got the translucent piece and translucent around your air housing clear bubble white on the inside look at the rear you got the lamborghini spoiler back here and you got that white line going around there you can see the white sock liner i haven't even put my foot in it yet in the sock liner appears to be dingy or is that just me but that's how it looks or this the material why it looks that dingy. You gotta have you have an embroidered midnight navy, jaw jump man on the rear, and embroidered letters A I R, which spells air on the back. Going to the medial side of the sneaker, you can see that number twenty three going on here. More of that tumble level on the inside. I was out in a, out and about today, and I saw this sneaker sitting. Uh, so if you still want to cop this sneaker for retail, check your stores because it's sitting, it's not really popular. You can get this shoe for retail. Looking at the midsole white on here, you got your midnight navy going around here with your translucent hits, going around the air housing again with the clear bubble with the white inside. Let's go ahead and look at the outsole of the sneaker. There you go, guys. The outsole you got that midnight navy hit. He iced out this time, translucent. This is a, a little different from the 
original one that came out in 2000. You have your white, white jaw jump man right here underneath on here. Now looking at the toolbox, I do have the shoe tree still in here. The white toolbox only come with one set of laces. You have the flat white laces and you have your neoprene like material on your tongue. You got your your cover right here that is white with the Midnight Navy Jordan Jumpman stitched on. You have your Midnight Navy Jordan push pin. You can see that right here. With your white Jordan Jumpman on here and to top it off on the tongue, your Midnight Navy right here. And this Air Jordan on here right there as well. Tall Bull Shoe Tree, size 13, 14. Nothing spectacular. Let's take a look at the inside of the sneaker. If we may. Look at the inside of the sneaker. You have a Midnight Navy insert. White Jordan jump, man. You have your size and sticker in here as well. And your size and tag. Your size and tag reads US size 14, production date, August, I'm sorry, March the 17th to June the 14th of last year. So these were in production for like three months. Now keep in mind, these were initially supposed to drop, well I'm not, I don't want to use the word initially. These were set to drop on Black Friday last year, 2021. However, we didn't get the sneakers for whatever reason. I don't know if they were sitting on the boat in the middle of the water. I don't know what happened, but we didn't get it on Black Friday. We finally got it this past weekend and here we go. The shoe almost flopped pretty much because it's still sitting in. Yeah, but that was Foot Locker. I saw those today. I also saw those 72 and 10. So if you guys uh, desire those sneakers and want them for retail, hit your stores. You gotta do that leg work though. But that's the sneaker Air Jordan Retro 6 Midnight Navy. It's your boy Titanic VJ. Like I always tell you, if you can help somebody get a sneaker, help them get that sneaker. Because you never know when it will be your turn. Needing help getting a sneaker. This Titanic VJ signing out.